biceps. Decided to get this. Angel decided to get it. Show you guys how it works real quick. It's gonna keep you away from cheating. What do you use? Keeps you nice and locked in. Catch up with that. Everything's relaxed. What I gotta do now is just focus on my biceps. I don't put my fingers at all. I go all the way down. Squeeze. Down step. Insta gains. <laughs> Go ahead, yo. Warm it up, yo. Just a warm up set. Make sure to pedal, yo. You heard? Hmm? Make sure you pedal. Pedal. That's what it says on your shirt. <laughs> <laughs> hey, this fucking shirt. I don't want none of this. <laughs> <laughs> Keeping the video short guys, so I'm just gonna narrate the rest. You know, jumping in right into you know barbell uh curls and now that I have this uh bicep bomber, definitely I mean I mean it definitely helps keep the shoulders out the movement. Love it. All you feel guys is your biceps when you when you're using it. Definitely recommend it for anybody that has lagging biceps and you're trying to get bigger arms. It will definitely, you'll definitely feel the contraction and you'll see better results. Just the fact that all you're using is biceps. You really can't cheat. It makes it really hard for you to cheat with it. And do three sets there, eight to 12 reps. And then on my last set, I jump into my fourth set, I jump into a drop set. You know, not going extremely heavy yet. Just the fact that I haven't been training biceps for, you know, a month and a half a couple a couple weeks ago since I had my you know my little forearm injury with tennis uh tennis elbow healed up now I'm back but trying to just you know go at go at a good pace because I will be guys I will be stepping on stage come April 2015 you know something I haven't been doing you know you know in 2014 is bringing good videos just the fact that I haven't had any motivation because I haven't been competing or I haven't been, you know, doing what I always do is, you know, every summer I like to cut down, you know, get it, get as lean as I can. It's something that I always enjoyed, you know, just for fun. And I didn't do in 2014. So I'm definitely going to start, you know, 2015 right, bring better videos, motivate a lot more people. You know, that's what people like to see, you know, good videos like that. That's what everybody enjoyed my channel. So I'm bringing that back, stepping on stage, guys. Get, uh, start winning some shows. And... As far as the, the bicep workout, you know, I, I finish off with a drop set and then I move on to seated, you know, seated dumbbell curls, uh, something that I saw on Chris Jones' channel. You know, he does seated uh, bicep curls and you stand up and then you just do as many as you can. A nice, uh, nice big superset, really good exercise. You know, it gets a nice, you get a nice real big pump and you definitely, you know, push your, your biceps to the, to the limit right there. Uh, once I'm finished with that one, I have a nice good pump, so I jump right into, you know, concentrated uh, bicep curls. It, it's a real nice way to get a nice contractions after, you know, your biceps have, have that nice big pump. You could definitely see my little peak trying to come out right there. Nice, nice. I like it. Get a good, nice good squeeze. And then after that, uh, I go into seated preacher curls. Pre seated preacher curls. I like to use one arm. You know, everything is. Uh, I like to keep it three sets. Keep it, you know, not too high in volume and not too low. Uh, just right for me. You guys can figure out, you know, what's right for you, what you can handle. And then I move on to, you know, some seated the uh, one arm bicep curls. You know, behind the neck. It's kind of similar to, you know, doing cables, cable flies, cable uh, bicep curls. And that's basically, uh, you know, a nice short uh, bicep workouts for you guys. Hope you enjoy it, and I'll talk to you guys next time.